What's going on guys? It's Brian with Buffalo Beer Reviews. Uh, today I have something weird. It's a conundrum. Uh, it's something I just can't wrap my head around. And I want to show you guys. It is the Purple Monkey Dishwasher Chocolate Peanut Butter Porter from the guys at Evil Genius Beer Company. I mean, let's just put that all together again. Chocolate peanut butter porter. It sounds awesome. I mean, it sounds like it has the potential to be awesome. Like, I love porter. It's a dark beer. I love porters. And chocolate and peanut butter. Like, it's a no-brainer, right? So... Let's see kind of what we're dealing with here. Uh, this is a 6.7% alcohol by volume American Porter. Um, I've heard some people describe it as a brown ale. I don't think that's accurate even in the slightest, despite if you review beer for Beer Advocate. This is a porter style. And I've had plenty of porters and I've had plenty of brown ales. This is nowhere as near a brown ale. I have no idea what you're even talking about. This is a porter style. So, without further ado, let's get a cap off this and see what it's all about. Again, this is the <laughs> Purple Monkey Dishwasher chocolate peanut butter porter from the guys at Evil Genius. So, absolutely nothing brown ale about that, please. Please. So this has a wonderful uh, pitch. I mean, this is almost borderline stout in appearance. It really is. Uh, with the with the, the color it's it's opaque it's black um, very dark um, this time around I, I just had one with the the second out of the three I just had one about an hour ago uh, this pour in this head is very nice it's about a finger's width um, nice tiny bubbles uh, the lacing isn't super impressive but I, I don't really care about that crap um, Let's see how it smells. Yeah, right up, right up front. It's this very. I, I feel like it's an, a, a processed peanut butter aroma. Not like um, like you're having some peanuts at a bar. No, this is this this is that powdered. Uh, peanut butter kind of stuff that you put in your 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 protein supplements and stuff like that it, 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 it smells processed it smells half artificial in my mind and that's the exact same sort of uh, impression that I've had for the all three of the beers that I've had so let's see how this tastes I mean, it's got a classic porter profile to it. It's not heavy. Uh, it's thin. It's not super heavy. And these are all things that I enjoy about a porter. Um, but I'm not really getting much on the chocolate part of the chocolate peanut butter porter. I mean, those processed peanut butter aromas, they go right in and they just sock you in, in the taste, in the body of this beer. And I feel like that's all that I'm fixated on. And 
despite all of these sort of critiques that I've seen on this beer on, say, Beer Advocate or uh, or Untapped and stuff, I feel like I'm I'm an outlier here. Like I, I don't know why I can't get around the flavor of this beer. I just Porter's okay. Uh, the the body of it is it's a medium body. It's a thin beer. Um, there's not really a, a whole lot of aftertaste to this beer, but you get socked with this dry, uh, artificial, powdery, peanut buttery flavor, and it's I don't know. It's I don't find it super enjoyable, and I'm really disappointed because. I wanted this beer to be really, really good. Like, I was looking, I read the name and the style, and I was like, I'm all in, dude. And I'm not so sure three beers in if I really would pick up this beer again or if I saw it on tap, if I would ever get it out of the tap. And that's too bad. I'll give it one more, though. Yeah, it's just the same old, same old. Um, I think any anything for me at least, it, it just gets overpowered and washed away by this processed peanut butter powdery bullshit. And I just don't find it as enjoyable as possible. So that's my take on the Evil Genius Purple Monkey Dishwasher Peanut Butter Chocolate Porter. Uh, I mean, if you don't believe me, uh, feel free to go and check it out on your own. And uh, if you disagree with me, let me know. Maybe I should look for something else uh, in the aroma or the flavor or whatever. I'm open for uh, critique, but that's my little take on this strange porter. Um, it's going to take me a little while to finish. I'm not going to lie to you. And after I'm done with this, I'm probably not going to ever drink another one, honestly. And that's too bad. Um, I usually don't give a whole lot of bad reviews because I dig beer, I dig porters, and this sounded really awesome. But that's me. Sorry, guys. So I hope this review would help you. If you ever see the, the evil genius guys out on tap, uh, I had um, the Stacy's Mom IPA, which I haven't reviewed on video yet, which I dug a lot. Nothing against uh, Evil Genius, uh, just not this beer. I think uh, next video or the next one after that will be uh, the Stacy's Mom IPA. That was wicked, dude. That was no, it's a no-brainer. But this one, hmm, maybe not. So... Until next time, cheers.